for the lag to catch up. Just one shot. Wow, this halberd is actually really powerful. It's got good range, too. That bunny was really juking me there. Okay, an alpha joust. How much health do these things usually have? <laughs> Still two shots. Two shots to death. That's actually not bad at all. Okay, let's go ahead and check out this spot over here. Yeah, that doesn't seem to do anything really negative to us. Okay. I don't know what this thing is, but I don't like it. That was a geist, I believe. Ah, uh, we got burnt to death. That's okay, though. That's not, like... That's not that bad. Um, we know where all our items are. Alright, uh, just pick up the last few things that we dropped. Okay, so we now know where, exactly where the spawners are. Really, my overall priority is to mine the spawner, not kill the enemies. But. I guess when you have to, you have to, right? Hyperthermia. There is some water over this way, I believe. There's water somewhere around here. Oh no, come on, just live. Live just long enough. Please. Okay. We made it to the water. Please, temperature, go down. So we did lose our halberd, unfortunately. Um, it's not very nice, but we'll go ahead and just time lapse being in the water here. Okay, so the temperature should have gone down just enough. Um, and actually now, we can put enough points into mining that we can go and get the iron from over here. Um, this specific spot actually looks pretty safe. So. Coal to be gathered here too. Coal equals EXP. Obviously iron equals iron. Uh, we do not want to mess with that. Ok, 
Okay, let's go ahead and jump back in the water again. I don't want to be getting hyperthermic while I have so much damage on my body. Well, I guess my damage isn't that bad. Um, let's drink up. Submerge ourselves and cool off a little bit. Keep an eye out for baddies in the water. Okay, let's go ahead and we'll go back to this spot just real quick. I wasn't sure if that flower was going to be explosive or not. Um, okay, now where are the spawners? spawners break already automatically from spawning too many enemies I guess so um, let's try to get back home before hyperthermia kills us I don't know what this white chalice is going to do. Oh yeah, you're not going to do anything useful for me. I was killed by, an, uh, by a lorry. That's okay. We're gonna go ahead and just we'll run back there. Uh, that wasn't very far away from home to go back to and grab items. Again, it's all about accepting certain kinds of deaths. You know, some of them are just very unavoidable, and you know you just have to be okay with that sometimes. Like this one that I might take, trying to get my items back. Okay. So I only got three of my iron ore back, but that's okay. I'm not going to be too picky about it. Okay, so let's go ahead and see what we still have. We still have quite a lot of our stuff. Um, let's go ahead and get this joust meat cooking. We'll bring the healing salve with us. Let's put our armor back on and cook this raw squid. And then let's take some actual food with us this time, instead of being dumb and leaving it all behind. And let's take some building blocks um, in the form of just a stack of cobble. We'll take a 64 stack of cobble with us, store away the important stuff, and take everything else. And this is going to be for us to go and get cobblestone out of that one spot. Uh, however, good thing I thought about this before I left, we need more sticks in order to make... A uh, new halberd because we did actually lose our halberd. Well, we didn't lose a halberd; it got broken. Okay, so three sticks and a piece of plant string, which I have in here. A piece of 
pieces of plant string, and then the pole, and four pieces there. Makes the halberd. Okay. Um, <laughs> store all that stuff away. Take the healing salve with us. Just in case it becomes needed. And let's head on back into that uh, cave that we found a little bit of iron in. Hopefully it's enough of an iron deposit that we get uh, some more armor. I'd like to have full iron armor as soon as possible. Let's just light that up a little bit more. up to the house, go make a deposit with all this iron that we've gotten, and call it a session. Um, let's make sure we didn't miss anything on the way up. Checking all the walls. And grab all these rocks on the way up too. There'll be a lot of cobblestone that we'll be able to use now that we've gathered a lot of it okay so let's go ahead and see what the spoils are from that mini adventure no xp the halberd didn't get to get put to use but you know that could be considered a good thing um i managed to have a mining session without something trying to kill me. So that's, that's something, you know. Okay, so let's see, what are the spoils we have? Roughly... Uh, I don't know how much cobble this is. We have two full stacks and 38 of cobblestone. We have some granite six pieces, and we have some andesite. This should be a total of eight pieces. Something of the sort. And we have some diorite as well. Okay. We also came back with 17 iron, which is actually quite a lot of iron to, you know, come back with. Um, we do want to split this between the two furnaces. And yeah, guys, so next time we'll be making something up with that iron and uh, hopefully moving into some more progression in the game. We're finally making some progress. I'm very happy now. Mm -hmm.